here. How many of you would agree that this market is in a very heavy strong bearish trend? I suppose everyone would agree this is true. And it's uh, it's not very difficult to spot this since we've seen very clearly that price is moving from the top left of the screen to the bottom right. So this is definitely a bearish trend. So let's see first how market moves in order to understand technical analysis and understand how to read the price chart here. Most of the time the price chart doesn't go this perfect, doesn't seem like perfect like this but it's just a very nice example to start with for beginners of course uh, before we go into more advanced charts and more real charts that happen most often than the one we see in front of us right now but let's just see here usually how the market moves even in a heavy bearish trend like this how do we see the movement let's stimulate this here so first of all we have a starting point that looks like this price make initial low and then a bull back this bull back could be big could be small it depends on the strength of the trend itself and then price should form a new lower low lower close than the previous low then price form a bull back mostly back into structure around here and it goes on and on and on so this is an example of how the market moves when it's in the bearish trend this is the perfect example here we're going to go through some more difficult examples to spot but that's not the purpose of this video here so now we have a deep understand here this will be our starting point here our initial low and then lower high than the previous high which was a starting point and then price form a new lower low at this point here after see this three wave move we are confirming that we are in a bearish trend so as a trend continuation trader if a trend continuation trader comes and see this situation I'm uh, I'm interested as a trend continuation into selling so of course I'm not going to sell at this low I'll wait for a bull back into structure which will be this zone in order to go short as a trend continuation as a counter trend trader would wait for the low and then for a chance to go long capture this small move uh, taking it back into structure so let's take a look at the real trend here and see how it moved All right we have our starting point here our initial low here first outside return forming a lower high before forming a new low where is that new low came it's exactly around this candle here right so this kind of from the lower low price get moving down moving down all right so let's stop here all right would that be considered a bull back and this is something we'll take a further look into in the future Right, so right now we'll just take this point as our new lower low this is our outside return a new low here outside return and as you can see again it didn't hit the previous structure also here it didn't hit the previous structure as well here as this outside return here it didn't hit the previous structure so this is an example of a very much of a perfect trend movement here. Next time we'll just learn how to capture this trend and how to use this trend if we are to trade within the direction of that trend here. Since right now we spotted that trend we have the three wave move by here. 
So all we have to do is to wait for